Hey, it's Clay, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol CAN. We will take a look at the 30-minute time frame. Not sure what I mean by 30-minute. I do offer an explanation video at that link. Quite the eventful day on this one, not only from the price action standpoint, but you look down here at the volume and well above average volume on the day. So a lot of eyeballs on this one moving forward. So let's map out some areas of support. And then we can talk levels of resistance. So the first level of support is what I would call the ideal level. I mean, if you say, Clay, you know, what make this chart look the absolute strongest going forward? And that would be if the price could say up here above $5.50. Don't get me wrong. If the price falls below $5.50, I'm not saying the entire chart's destroyed or ruined or anything like that. But yeah, if the price could manage to stay above that level, that would certainly be a great sign of power moving forward. Taking a step back and looking at all this from the bigger picture point of view, that is where the purple line there comes into play, the 50 period, simple moving average, keyword being moving. So as time goes by, that line is going to move itself higher and higher, which is very helpful because when it comes to gauging the health of the move, that right there is how I'm defining, quote unquote, the move. Just watch that purple line. As long as the price stays above that line, as the line itself moves higher and higher, then the bulls are in full health, the bulls are in full control. How you must visualize that, that is what has been represented. Again, yeah, standing above 550 would be great. But from the grand scheme of it all, as long as the price is above that purple line, the bulls 100% own the chart. As far as areas of resistance are concerned, they just really don't matter. What do I mean by that? Well, what matters the most is what the price has already been doing and continues to do, and that's this right here. Just chipping away and building these higher lows, or if you want to envision those as stair steps. So in other words, as long as these stair steps continue to construct themselves in the upward direction, then given it enough time, everything else will eventually take care of itself, including breaking levels of resistance. So folks on healthy consolidations, folks on chipping away and building those higher bases and sit back and let the overall trend do its thing. First off, thanks so much for watching the entire video. Real quick, before you go, I wanna invite you to a live webinar, web class, training, workshop, online event, whatever you wanna call it, but it will be me live revealing to you what I discovered that has allowed me to transform myself from being an employee to being my own boss, including how I had only one losing day out of 73 days in total. I'm going to cover three keys that have helped me unlock profitable consistency within the markets. The first key is super weird, but in a productive type of way. The second key is super awesome because it quite literally is wired into our DNA as humans, making it very easy to use. But in a cruel way, this becomes a pitfall for many traders. I'll explain it all though, including how to avoid the pitfall that it creates for some. And yeah, the third key, when you hear it, sounds way too good, way too, good to be true, but it's not, and I'll show you how it all works. Then at the end, I open it up for a question and answer session that is, again, totally live. Even if you can't make the live session, please still sign up as it will be recorded, and you can go back and watch the replay that I will send you. Click the image on the screen or click the link down in the description box so you can get the date and time and claim your spot, which I should note is limited due to the fact that this truly is a live event. If you have any questions, let me know. If not, I'll be seeing you soon.